Hey, we are in a store. Actually, uh, my kids and I are killing some time. We just went to see a movie and uh, we went to see Despicable Me 3, which was really good. We enjoyed that. And then we're going to go see Cars 3 because my older son hasn't seen it. My younger son and I went to see it one day. And it's really good. I, I feel like the first Cars movie, you'll like the third one. I really liked it. Um, we're going to go see that. We have like an hour where we don't have anything to do. So we're in Family Dollar, which is right next door to the movie theater. And I'm going to walk around and show you some of the stuff in here. Um, it's sort of like a, it's not a dollar store. It's not a store where everything is a dollar. But it's like a discount store. Kind of like if you have Dollar General in your area. It's like that. So we're going to walk around and look at some stuff. Because I have some extra time. I don't really have anything else to do until the next movie starts. So here we go. Now I am, right now I, I just came in like the doors over there and I just came in and this is the right hand corner like when you come in the store. Um, see right there's the door. So you come in and you have uh, products here like the drugstore products. You have allergy medications here. You like have Claritin and then you have Family Wellness looks like uh, that's the store brand of you know just the brand name drugs. They have Family Wellness for Benadryl and Claritin. They have the pills and the liquid, cough medication, uh, vitamins, cough drops, that kind of stuff. And then over here, I was looking at these these uh, sort of like a jog bra or a sports bra. They don't have any of my size. It's actually not a bad deal. It's nine dollars. It's nine dollars, and you get two of them for that, which is pretty cool. And they're nice. I wear these at the gym a lot, and I wear um, a tank top over it. Um, I like this. This is, um, these are $8, like this, but, um, and then these are just, they have, like, different styles and stuff, but they don't, they don't have any of my size, which is a pain, but, oh well, and they have uh, matching panties down there, and then over here we have lady socks and underwear, like these socks, these are nice, um, underwear. And then they have some, I guess these are girl sizes, socks and underwear. And then they have boy socks. These are cool. Like you get three pairs of these pro player performance ankle socks for $3. It's really good. Here's some black ones. I like these. And my younger son likes these kind of socks right here. He's got a bunch of them right now. I bought him a whole bunch. And then we have longer socks. Oh no, I'm sorry, they're not. These, these are still ankle socks here. I think these actually belong over here somewhere. I don't know. But uh, then they have underwear. Oh, look. These little kitty pools. Look, it's so cute. I remember um, I had several of these as a kid. And it just seemed like the greatest thing when I was little. And then they have end caps with all kinds of different items on them. We have... Uh, some more drugstore type items like uh, antacids and then first aid items. I may come back through here actually because I need some band-aids. I need some large band-aids like that. I went to get one the other day and found out we were out. Um, looks like they have the band-aid brand, some different kinds. Um, and then they have the family wellness again. Um, like the, they have neon and waterproof strong strips. Bacitracin, antibiotic ointments. Then you have the brand name of Neosporin. Um, and all kinds of antacids up there. And there's the security camera, <laughs> one of them. Uh, and then they have hair products. Little things like ponytail holders. Uh, back when I had long hair, I had probably 5,000 of these <laughs> scrunchies. I wore them all the time. <laughs> I had long hair for a really long time. And then I decided to go with shorter hair. Oh, look. A little flower pin. That's cute. My kids have gone to look at the toys. I'm sure they'll come over here shortly and show me something cool they found or ask me to come look at something. Here's a fluff and shower comb set. And then we have wrap caps, bonnets, scarves. And up here we have a roller set. I like these, but they pull my hair out. It's kind of annoying. Magnetic snap-on rollers. Hair uh, trimmer. Curling irons. Straighteners. Hair blow, uh, hair dryers. 
let's see. And over here we have the clearance section where you can find just about anything. Oh, these are cute. Look at these shoes. Too small for me, but they're kind of cute. I wear a nine. I can't wear those. So window panels, paint pots. Oh, they even have poker chips. Oh, I bet that would make a nice video. I bet this would make a nice sound right there. Oh, fake nails. Oh, they're not long enough for our sparkly friend, unfortunately. I have a little makeup kit. I have this. I have one of these. This pearl metallic. It's a liquid liner by LA Colors. I didn't like it. The color is not very good at all. Ooh, a lock for $285. Funny thing is the lock has a lock on it. Right here. <laughs> Lockception. Um, sometimes they have <laughs> items over here that have been opened. Like one's been removed. Like here, one of these scrunchies has been removed. Um, what's this? Ooh, trouser socks. That's cool. And up there they have a stock pot and a blender. More poker chips and some dice. These dice might make a nice sound. Oh, I hear a kid of mine coming. Gun that's supposed to be a cap gun. You have popcorn dust all over you. No, I don't. Do you? Can I please get a cap gun that's supposed to be based off an M4A1? Can I see a happy face? <laughs> I'll, I'll go look at it in a minute, okay? Or, or those Hot Wheels. I'll look at them in a minute. I knew one of them would come over here and ask for something. More clearance. Oh, look. Look at these band-aids. These are cool. Do they actually look like that? That's neat. I'm going to come back over here and look at this in a little bit more. Uh, I'm going to look at it a little closer. Oh, look at that color. My goodness. That's very light. <laughs> I don't think I'm ready to go that light with my hair. And they have these three drawer things. These are cool. Oh, and they have a little, like a little lock. This is only $12 for these three drawers. And they have them in white and blue and then black. That's interesting. Look at that. And then they have items for the home. And they, uh, they always have things like this, like, um, flower arrangements for uh, for grave sites. They always have different kind of displays. Here we have, ooh, look at these pillows. That's cool. Wall hanging there. And even more pillows. Here's a long, like a body pillow kind of thing. All these different color pillows down here. Some backpacks. I'm not ready to think about that kind of stuff yet. The school just got out. Oh, look at these cute little dresses. Oh. Six dollars. No, these are ten dollars. That's adorable. Look at that little dress. How cute. Oh, and here's a black and white one. That's so cute. Oh my goodness. That's adorable. This is six dollars. That's a sh I think that's just a shirt. Pants. They say love on them. Well, here's some more of these dresses here. $12.50. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, they are $12.50. Yeah. Oh, they have like a burgundy and white stripe and black and white. That's adorable. You have a, this is an interesting long sleeve dress here. I got a call from my dad right before we went into the movies, and um, he's been building a train. Not, not, not a literal train. These are plus sizes here. These are all shirts. He's been building this uh, train that has a motor in it. Like, um, I'm not sure what kind of motor it is, but it, it's, um, you can drive it. I like these pants. Look at that. I would love to have a pair of these in my size. Those are cool. These are all plus size. Oh, and they have kids' shoes. So he's built this train, and he's spent a long time on it. Um, he had to make a lot of the components himself. Look at these flip-flops. Because he said he knew how he wanted it to be. But um, 
he couldn't find the right parts so he ended up having to build a lot of the different parts of the train and he's got it all ready and on Independence Day he's going to take it to a friend's house they're having a big cookout um, at, at a friend at the house of a friend of his I have some of these bracelets like I have this one and this one and this one I don't have a black one though cool so we're invited to the barbecue on Independence Day so um, I'm thinking we might actually go up there I would love to see his train. I've been looking forward to seeing it for several months. He's been working on it. And um, I've only seen a few pictures. Oh, that's cute. The groovy baby. I don't have any kids anywhere near that small. Um, all these little shoes. These are cute. Look at those. Look at that. Kind of like Chuck Taylors. So I'm going to go up there on Independence Day with my kids. And we're going to go to the cookout. And maybe I'll get to drive the train. I don't know if it's big enough for an adult to drive, but I'm thinking it is. It has a swivel seat where you sit. You can sit in it and swivel into the train to make it easier to get in and out. This bedroom slippers. Shoes like that. So we're going to go up there on Tuesday. And uh, I'll try to get some video of the train to show you what it looks like. I know it's going to be cool because my dad makes the coolest stuff. He can make anything. He is so good at that. I don't need any more sheets, my goodness. I already have so many sets of sheets. It's ridiculous. And a mirror. Hey. <laughs> Ooh, the balloon corral. So that's what we're going to be doing on Independence Day. I'm going to go up to Virginia and see my dad. I've been meaning to get up there. I need some of these. I have some of these. I needed some more. I'm going to grab some of these before we go. They're picture hanging strips, and they work great. My son, my older son, has several posters that he likes to put up in his room. And these work great for hanging posters. I'll come back and get some of those. Every journey in life begins with a little faith. I would say courage, but I guess faith applies also. A little party favors, like a tiara. That's adorable, actually. I wonder if that would fit me. I guess it matters. <laughs> oh, look at that bag. It's so sparkly. Beaded necklaces. We could get four for a dollar. Red one, green, gold, and blue. That's cool. A lot of their prices are really great. Like, look at these little lamps here. These are six dollars. These little glass lamps. And this one is also six dollars. Oh, and these are six dollars. These are cute. And look at these glasses. Ooh, sneaker balls. I bought these one time, and they, they're they way too powerful. The smell is so potent. It's overpowering. I had to throw them out. Yes. Uh, there may not be one in here. Didn't you just go? Uh, walk over to Food Line. They probably have one. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. We got the big drinks at the theater, and... <laughs> My son needs to use the bathroom, and they don't, I don't think they have bathrooms in here. Not for the public, anyway. Look at these towels. Aren't they cool? I like that stripe there. It's cool. These are $5 each for these nice towels. And then they have, um, they have different colors and designs. See, these are the same. They're just different colors. And then they have these bathroom sets where you get a wastebasket tumbler, toothbrush holder, and a soap dish. It's not bad. It's only $5. I need another trash can. Uh, we, have an, when you go, we have one more bathroom now than we had in the apartment. And I need a trash can for the, the bathroom. Oh, that bag is trippy. Look at that. Oh, I love that. And they have these <laughs> a massaging bathtub mat. Massage of mat. Ooh, it's hairy. <laughs> All kinds of different shower curtains. A textured shower curtain. Fabric. Metallic. Look at that. Ooh, this one's cool. I like that. This one's trippy. Oh my goodness. Look at that. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> $10 seems like a bit much. 
Now, I love these towels, these little cheap thin towels. These are, these are what I call my hair towels. When I get out of the shower, I always wrap up my hair in a really thin towel. Like these are only $2.50. And they're a lot thinner than the others, and it's a lot more comfortable to, to use in my hair. I always keep three or four of these hair towels around. They're they're really cheap, so they they're not good for regular towels, but they're perfect for wrapping up my hair. Ooh, I like that comforter set. That's cool. I have so many blankets. Oh my god, I don't need any more blankets. Oh, pillows. Oh, and they even have area rugs in here all different and then they have a picture of what it looks like and then we get into cleaning supplies I need a dust mop I wonder if they have a dust mop in here I need one I have all the um, laminate downstairs and I really need a dust mop they have a lot of regular mops dish uh, dish cleaning microfiber cleaning pads how much is that I don't know you want that and ring caps? 160. Wait, instead of this, can I get a police set? Where? Come on, I'll hide. Um, well, I'm busy right now. <laughs> I'll get over there. Oh, they have more wreaths here. Oh, look at this big picture back here. I'll move these to show you. This is cool. Look. Oh, I like it. It's $20. Look at that. Oh, I found a, um... I see it. It's cool. Yeah. This part is red. Mm -hmm. and that part is yellow. I like it. I'll have to think about it. Cleaning supplies. Oh, a duster. I need one of these. It's a microfiber duster. I could, that's something I could really use right there. I have several brooms, actually, uh, the guy that owned the house before me, I have found, I think, three or four brooms that he left. <laughs> so I'm good on brooms. I don't need a broom, but I really could use a dust mop. I'm not seeing one, though. Lots of um, cotton mops, but not a dust mop. That's okay. I know where I, I could get one at Walmart. Laundry detergent. We have Sun uh, and Purex Gain. Tide. You know what though? I just got some laundry detergent. I needed some and I was in Dollar Tree and I got a little container of laundry detergent. It was about the size of this and I think it was actually made by this company. Uh, totally awesome. And it really works great and it has, I think it does 20, it does 20 some loads and it was only a dollar and it works really well. I was surprised. Um, I've been using detergent from Aldi, but honestly, this stuff at the dollar store works great. <laughs> and it's, it's really cheap. <laughs> so then here we have um, fabric soft. No, this is, I guess these are detergents. Yeah. More detergents. Oh, and something about, I don't know how it is where you are, but one thing that gets stolen a lot is laundry detergent. Um, so they had to start putting these tags on them, the security tags, so it will set off an alarm when they go through the front door. That's been a real problem around here for several years now, people stealing laundry detergent. And then they resell it. But see, they all have the security tags on them. It's just kind of a weird thing. And then we have dishwashing liquid. They don't have my favorite. My favorite is a Dawn product, but it has some oil of a lay moisturizer in it, and I really like it because it doesn't leave my hands feeling all dry and gross. And then we have Lysol. This is the Lysol I use, the clean and fresh uh, lemon scented. I don't really crazy about the, the way the other ones smell. I don't really like it. All kinds of cleaners and bleach and ammonia wipes. Kid in my way. <clears throat> oh my god, look at the size of that refill. This is two, this is three. Then we have some pet products. 
we're not even looking at the entire store. It's crazy because this store is not very big, but they have tons and tons of stuff in here. Oh, look. This is another, this is another, a brand here. I'll have to come back and look at that. That's only $2. It's cheaper than the command strips. I don't need their yakking in my video. The nervous some people when you're trying to shop. They even have a food section. Check it out. They even make their own coffee. Look, this is roast coffee by Family Gourmet. Because this is Family Dollar. And McCafe from McDonald's. And then we have Gatorade. Now these are drink mixes. I buy these quite a lot. See, they're little singles and you put them in a bottle of water. Um, well, we go through spells where we use those for a while and then they don't want them anymore. But they're really cheap. You get eight of them in a, in a pack for a dollar. It's not bad. Apple juice. And again, it's, oh, it's family gourmet. Again. And a can of pineapple juice. But that's by Dole. Ew, energy drinks. <laughs> Rip it. Yep. Stacker. And then they have two liter drinks. And then you come over here and you have deodorant. Look at that. Oh my god, look at that contour palette. That's enormous. They don't have much in the way of uh, cosmetics. It's mostly wet and wild. Uh, they have some Maybelline, and they have LA Colors, kind of like what you find at Dollar Tree. They have these there's all different kinds of fake nails. Oh, these are tiny. Look how small those things are. Those are, that has to be for little kids. They're tiny. Oh, and then they have hair dye. See? Oh, all the different colors for hair. And then they have some hair products here. Oh, spam. Look, look at all this canned meat. <laughs> we have uh, Vienna bites, Vienna sausages, potted meat, chicken spread, deviled ham, chicken salad, tuna salad, and then canned uh, chicken, corned beef, ham, mackerel. Oh my god, boiled oysters. Ugh. Tuna. Gigantic containers of Hawaiian punch. Wow. Lots of food. Oh, and then we have uh, shampoo and conditioner, liquid soap. That's all they have as seen on TV items. Why are all these people talking? Ooh, and then they have kitchen items. A meat tenderizer, basting brush, pizza cutter, really just about anything you could need. Plates. Then they have sets of plates down there and bowls for $15. It's really not bad at all. Um, they have plastic food storage. video off. The reason we're here today is because, um, oh my god, look at that, that's glass, that's really heavy. We went to look at, um, check out the dogs at the local Humane Society. We're close to where I grew up, and we went back to the place where we got Evie last fall. Um, look, eight plastic dinner plates. That's cool. And we went to check out the dogs. I'm not quite ready to get one yet. I'm going to have a doggy door installed. One with an electric, an electronic doggy door. With, where they have um, a thing on their collar that activates the door. I've been looking at some on Amazon. I haven't quite decided which one to get yet. But um, 
I want to wait until I have the doggy door installed before I get a dog so they can come and go. And we have a fenced-in backyard so they can go back there if they need to and they can go in and out through the back door. Um, oh, that's cute. Look at the little mini storage boxes. And see, this is called Family Chef. So I'm going to get the doggy door installed, but I wanted to go down there and talk to the ladies that work there. And um, I talked to the lady that I talked to when I adopted Evie and explained the situation and told her the kind of dog we were looking for. You know, I want one that is housebroken, good with cats, of course, good with kids. Look at these placemats. And uh, they don't really have anything right now that fits what I'm looking for, but I left my name and number with her. She knows my mom and dad, so it's kind of cool. And uh, she'll let me know if anything comes up, if um, any dogs come in. She said, you know, they get... These cups are cool. It's really trippy. I like that one. I like this one, too. She'll let me know if a dog comes in that fits the description of what I'm looking for. And... If and when a dog comes in, we can go down there and visit with the dog. But I want to get that doggy door put in really soon. I need to go ahead and decide which one I want to buy. Ooh, a placement with flowers on it. See, I like these bowls. Like this one has a toucan on it. That's cute. But um, I'm going to actually go look around now and see what I might like to buy. And here we have another aisle. This is a whole other aisle of uh, food items. Ooh, tropical gummy worms. <laughs> Made with real fruit juice. That makes it healthy, doesn't it? And they have all kinds of canned vegetables, uh, canned fruit, raisins, applesauce, pineapple, peaches, mixed fruit, mandarin, mandarin oranges. That sounds awful. Peaches and strawberry gel. That just sounds disgusting. Ooh. And then they have all these little containers here. These are cute. Oh my god, this one's adorable. Look at that. Look at those little things. And then they have quad chairs. I've been meaning to buy a few of these. At least three. Where the kids and I would all have one. I've been thinking about doing that. And then they have outdoor items. Things that you can decorate your yard with. Oh, look. <laughs> it's a it's a springy cat. <laughs> it's cute. Little tables and a box fan. Glass bulbs you use these to water your plants with. Pretty cool. And wind chime. <laughs> it bounces. It's only three dollars. Has a little little bell. This one's pretty too. I have a Volkswagen bus hanging up in my backyard <laughs> instead of a wind chime. <laughs> I have to show it to you sometime. What? I love you. I love you too. I Sparkly choose, glasses. I choose what I want. Okay. Those are pretty. I have at home, I have a million of these little things. I have so many of these cups. And I never use any of them. Oh my, I don't even know where they all come from. They just show up. Is it? <laughs> That's the best cup. You have insect spray. I have a question. You have a question? What's your question? What, what I mean, the question. This is totally good. Okay. Totally. Ooh, nozzles. Okay, I'm going to go shop, I think. <gasps> Look at that squishy bed bed. So, anyway. Um, this is most of Family Dollar. I mean, there's more stuff here than just this. Ooh, look at that. But, uh, we're going to go browse and see what we can find. And, um, I mean, there's a lot in here to be as small as it is, but it's really cool. So, I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, it's going to be kind of late when I get home tonight, because when we get done watching the second movie, we'll probably go to my mom's house for a little bit. I may actually make a video there. I brought all my stuff, so I might make it there. So, I hope you have a wonderful day, and I'll see you again soon.